Oh, what the? It can it animates you taking a sh oh, and I can close the door. And what the? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Contraband Police. Jumping back in to secure the checkpoint all over again. This time, the second way around, we are going to really emphasize taking all the bribes that we get at the checkpoint. And uh, also, someone mentioned last episode that there's like briefcases strewn around the map, uh, I guess, which has money in them. Didn't know that. We're going to see if we can at least try to locate one today. I guess there was one or two inside the actual checkpoint area. So nonetheless, let's go ahead and jump into Contraband Police and see what we can get into starting off today on a new chapter chapter two uh that is we've got something on the board okay so this one is drivers carrying goods from goods and luggage from the kingdom of Erki are prohibited from entering so that's interesting i honestly do not remember that i wonder if that was a thing last time or if this somehow changes maybe a little i don't know I have your documents sir thank you so much uh why don't you step out of the car Okay, or not. Just look at me like I'm an idiot. Uh, so I'm going to look around really quick as he's stepping out. Someone said that it was by the KGB files. Son of a bit. Only a hundred? You got me fucked up. Where's the briefcase, motherfucker? I know it's here. Where's the briefcase? Hey, nope, nope. Not there, I guess. Let's just continue. We'll do a little bit of both. So does this guy have any luggage that would, like, stop him immediately? All right, we'll check his car out, too. Seats look good. Everything looks good up there. What was the one thing or one place? Oh, yeah, it was up here at the air filter. Nope, no markings on that or the oil pan or whatever it is. Okay, I think this is going to be good. So let's uh, take a look at this guy's stuff. We have an entry permit as Sevda Imanaliev. Okay, we fucked that name. I'm sorry. Uh, let me just make sure. We have a discrepancy on that. We are no longer in training, too. So we're on our own with this one. Uh, July 2nd, 1981. So expiration. He's good on that. November 10th, 1980. Expired. Uh, is that what he looks like? Jesus Christ, you're even uglier in real life. Um, I don't think that's him. I can't tell. I would use this, yeah, like his chin here is very specific. Can't really tell with that. No, the indents in his cheeks are definitely not the same. You are just an asshole for doing that, sir. Uh, let's check this. Bravo, Robert, Oscar, Young. Bravo, 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 Robert, Oscar, Young. Why is that a tongue twister? Frank, David, three, George. Frank, David, three, George. Okay, looks good. So he's definitely not going to get through. I already don't remember the specification that we're supposed to be doing. Um, commodity embargo. So if they're the easiest way to break it down is if they're carrying anything, uh, goods or luggage from Turkey, then they're prohibited from entering. Uh, any discrepancies in the cargo list? We already knew that. So this guy doesn't have any cargo list. And he's still going to get turned around, though, because everything else is fucking wrong. Uh, his passport number did check out. Entry regulations. No, it would just be everything else is fucking wrong. All right, sir. Not today. You step back in your car, please. If you try to go forward, I will unload my weapon into your face. Okay? It's real simple. Don't try to do anything stupid. I'm opening the next one next. Like I said, I got a couple rounds and I'm a wicked shot in this bitch. Don't do anything stupid. That's right. Keep it pushing. How you doing, sir? What? I was not going to have to kill him. Just listen to everything I say and you won't die. Can I get your uh, documentation? Perfect inspection. Why is it so cheap at the lower levels? Step out of the car. Listen, man. Anything you say, one, I don't care. And two, I can't understand you. So uh, let's uh, check this guy's car. We got a broken window here. I don't think we're doing that yet. Nope, we're not. So I guess that's just something we're going to have to overlook. Let's keep paying attention to it so we don't end up fucking ourselves when we actually get to the point of needing to actually do that. I've seen no contraband. I've seen no contraband here lately. So I'm not sure if anyone's smuggling or we're doing something else. This guy also doesn't have any cargo. Bruh. What you looking at? Is there something over there? What are you looking at, sir? You got drugs hidden between those pallets or something? <laughs> That'd be great if there was like a mark there. All right. Um, I think this is going to be document related. 
He is not from that area where it matters. So B O R Y S B O R Y S M I K H A M I K H A Y L O V Y L O V. Okay. So Frank, I'm sorry, for Frank Tom Oscar, for Frank Tom Oscar, King X Ray 3 9. December 12th, 1981, good. September 16th, 1981, good. Birthday doesn't matter. So I think this one's going to be a push because I haven't literally made a single check on this bitch the whole time. I'm just going to do one more sweep of here because I didn't even look in here. Yeah, I don't think we got anything, to be honest. Very nice, sir. You're going to be able to let go since I'm not looking at inspections elsewhere with your vehicle. It's a piece of shit, but it doesn't matter. All right, you're going to be free to go. Watch this be wrong. I really want to do my best concerted effort here to actually pass everyone. Because I feel like that was just stuff I was overlooking as time went on. Next. Good day, sir. I told you I wasn't going to shoot you in the face. Fix your window. Fucking tire busted. Busted ass tire. How you doing, sir? Perfect inspection. God damn, we're doing good. Uh, okay, documentation. Thank you so much. Okay, sure. Uh, please step out of the vehicle. What the fuck look was that? See, that just reminded me of like every time I go to launch this game, I see this one screenshot each time of like how happy the person is inside the car and like the checkpoint guy is happy to be there. This guy looks like he just shit his pants. And I just, I, I'm, I'm so confused. I get in the game and I'm like, I don't know what the fuck checkpoint they're at, but put me on that one. Get me the fuck off this one. All right, just hang tight. Let me check your vehicle. Please don't be a smuggler. He has luggage, so I have a feeling this is going to correlate with the entry regulation thing. I just saw something which is not really good. I need a knife. Shit, hold on. Oh, I got a knife. Uh, sir, stay right there. If you do anything stupid, I'm going to either slice you or shoot you, depending on the circumstances. There we go. I don't remember them being in the headrest often, so I guess that's interesting. I'm going to unpack that, but since we do have a confirmed on the contraband, I'm going to just put them in custody really quick. Although I don't think they run, but still, might as well. All right, stay right there. We'll uh, continue searching the whole vehicle. That way we don't have to worry about him shanking us in the neck or whatever the case may be. And uh, we might have them in several locations. They could be inside tires, fenders, bumpers. Oh, like we got here. So I'm going to use uh, axe. Is that working? I definitely will need to get tools here shortly. Three. Okay, watch out. We out here. Let me grab those. I save one for myself. Uh, okay, nothing over here. I'm going to look at the uh, trunk. Because if this guy's smuggling that much, you already know it's about to be everywhere. Is there really none in here? It's a bunch of horse shit. That can't be correct. I don't know. He was uh, more on a sophisticated level, I guess, than other people who just shove it. Oh, there we go. We usually, uh, we end up missing some of these. That's why we didn't get perfect inspections, even though we caught them in the contraband. Like, there's some silly easy ones, but then some of them are actually pretty difficult. What, the actual fuck? Really? God damn it. Okay, let's, uh, get some of my shit dumped off here. Move all this off. I, oh god, I need to upgrade this storage thing and fast. That's probably going to be the first thing that we work on. Just so we don't get screwed here. Alright. Oh, God. He has two chickens in the back. What the fuck is this guy doing? Oh, it's a fake chicken. I thought it was real. That son of a... You're sneaky. Jesus Christ. These motherfuckers in there. Goddamn fake-ass animals. You good in there? I might chop you up for dinner later. We'll figure it out. I think that's going to be it, though. I literally don't think there's going to be anything. Oh, hold on. Oh, this motherfucker. Thought I wasn't even going to check it all. That's the first time I've actually seen it in the thing, though. Did we have to do, like, a whole playthrough to see different outcomes and scenarios? All right. I want to say that that's it. Any more, and it's in his ass. I mean, honestly. All right. Inspection complete. Let's see. Did we miss one? Eight out of eight. That was perfect. Fantastic. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Next. 
We're really doing a good job this time around. I think Comrade's going to do a lot less yelling. How you doing, sir? That vehicle is dreadfully small. You know that, right? Hi. Uh, give me your information, please. Yes. Coming from uh, Erky or Arky, whatever it is. I don't know. Oh, good, good. Okay, he is, and he has luggage, so I'm going to have to turn him around immediately. Anyone carrying goods or luggage from Erky is prohibited from entering. So that's a bad day for you. I got to continue with the inspection, though, to see if you were trying to smuggle drugs into the beautiful country here. Which chances are he's just trying to get in, but uh, unfortunately, I like how I'm still going to run through his shit, even though I'm going to turn him around. Oh, God, he had a lot of stuff. No, I'm not wasting your time. I'm just making sure all your documents check out before uh, I send you through. <laughs> Said no one. All right, I think his vehicle's good. I didn't see anything else inside here that I could pull anyways. Uh, let's check his luggage here. As we saw with the last guy, he actually had stuff in it, so that was shocking. Wasn't expecting that. Other than that, let me do a quick check, make sure there's no markings on those. All right, you can throw that shit back. He's going to get turned around anyways, so. All right, sir. So I have to also, before, I wish I could just, like, kick him out and not have to do my inspection report properly, but uh, let's just immediately do that. Oh, wait, hold on. I guess we could... Motherfucker. I'm going to just double check this really quick just to make sure that he has everything counted correctly for my documentation. So five luggage, two fertilizer. Good on that. Uh, Masner Salive. Masner Salive. Good with that. Uh, 870X. 870X. C70R. Good. June 17th, 1981. Solid. And uh, February 28th. So he's definitely... Yeah, definitely expired on that. So we're going to do expiration dates. I think his face checks out. No, my God. This guy's so much older, is he not? Why is this taking so long? Because you use the incorrect documentation and you're using fucking buddy fucking Benjamin's goddamn picture here. Yeah, I want to say that that's definitely not him. The eyebrows are not lining up. They're like different colors. Like they kind of have that same point there. I don't know. Maybe it is. No, I think so. Because, like, he has this, like, weird curved lip. No, that's not him. Your lip's not curved. I'm going to have to say that that's not it. I'm going to go with my gut instinct here, and let's see. Everything else is checking out. But uh, he's going to have to be turned around. All right, sir. So, today, not so good. Although, I might have fucked up on one of it. But, okay, it's I will have to pay for it, sir. Yeah, you need to shut up. Okay? Shut up. Get out of here. Next. And don't do anything stupid, too. Because, like the last guy, I'll fucking cut you if I have to. I'll shut your hood, though. But I will stab you. That was really aggressive. How you doing? Oh, I should have took the other guy's chicken for dinner. Uh, can I take your uh, documentations? Oh, we fucked up. I think it was a photo. The surname cargo list. But, uh, fuck, I don't know. That reading that is like reading fucking Egyptian or something. I just don't know. All right, step out of the car, sir. Okay, let's check this guy's vehicle. Make sure there's nothing inside of it. Chances are it's just going to be a normal push because that would have been a lot of smugglers. If not, things checking out so far. Battery had kind of like an illuminated S there. It kind of looked like it was a... All right. Solid, solid. Anything in the back? Nope. Trunk? Nope. All right, where are you going? So this is going to be one of the opposite ones where it's like, hey, you paying attention? This one's going to probably going to be a solid pass. Uh, Sevda Saburov. Oh, that's right on the cargo list. Had his name. But you can't individually, like... I really wish you could. Where, it, like, maybe under surname, it, it said, like, each option. Like, said he fucked it up on this. So instead of saying it's fucked up everywhere, we could specify it. Because that's what I think it's trying to tell me. Or I'm losing it. I don't know. Anyways. Uh, let's make sure we keep this out. So, 3681. 3681. 8486. 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 
And he's there for tourism anyway. So December 29th, 1952, October 1st, 1981. Good on that. Yeah, this is going to be a straight push. No discrepancies or anything that's going to fuck him up. And that's his face. All right, sir. Sorry about the flashlight. I'll get that turned off. Uh, we can go ahead and push you in today. You have a fun time out here in the middle of fucking nowhere. Yes, yes. You weren't even there for that long. Shut the fuck up. Okay, good solid day. As soon as he rolls out, uh, we'll probably spend some of this money on upgrading because we need to do that as we're going. I don't think they're going to take as much this time. Oh, I need to see if I can try to find that briefcase before we sleep. Nice. I should probably uh, leave to go get... Cool. That's where you've been the whole time? Lay off the acid, man. Shit. Yeah, I don't see any briefcases or anything that would be like... Oh, hey, look at me. Put some of this shit in here really quick. We still look like we have plenty of tools, at least for right this second. Let's see if I can take a peek around and find that uh, briefcase. It wouldn't be in like a trashy area, I feel like. Oh, God. I didn't even know I could knock those over. I would like to see if I could find them without being told where they're at, since I know they're there at least. When I go out and do the story missions, which I will have to do this time around too, I can at least pay attention to, uh, like, look around areas. Because I know that there was weird stuff in other missions where you could, like, dig up parts of, like, dirt. And I didn't keep going. Well, every time I did it, they shot at me, but you know what they say. I mean, yeah, I wonder how far we can actually go out here. Oh, there's a fence. You know, I'm leaving the outpost. As you travel across the world of our blah, 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 watch out for enemy gang troops. They will recapture their comrades and reclaim their stolen... It's not like I'm carrying them with me. What the fuck? When you encounter them, you can run away or fight them and get an additional reward. Oh, God, I just almost broke my mic. I did break my mic. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, anyways, now that I've fixed that issue with the microphone, uh, let's see if we can look around just a little bit more if it's not just kind of like blatantly obvious those kgb files were pretty you know it's like hey oh god nice oh it did come back with the textures that was weird all right nothing 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 oh shit oh what the fuck it can it animates you taking a shit oh and i can close the door and what the fuck okay well i got another hundred maybe that was it though and then it just gives you like a little extra money that has to be and then the other ones have to be kind of scattered around the map, I would say. that That's kind of cool. I did not pay attention to that for shit the last time. Uh, let's go ahead and get an outpost upgraded really quick. I don't think that's it. Yeah, this one. I think the best thing would be, damn, 750? Holy shit. Well, the warehouse would definitely be a good idea. So that way we could uh, hold more. All right, let's upgrade. It was a little depressing, holy shit, but at least we get to use it this time, instead of not getting it, I guess, or getting it taken, theoretically. All right, now we can sleep, get the new day started, get another shift of people in here. All right, we got a new day. Let's go ahead and see what we got. Same stuff on the board. Let's get this guy just insta-rolling in here. Uh, I'm going to dump some of the more stuff that I have in my new post here. I have nothing else. Well, I guess I have two pages, so I can at least uh, separate them really quick. Watch that guy run. I'm back here. Fucking not even able to do anything. Just going to take all this shit out. That should be plenty. I don't think I ever need the pitchfork anyways. How you doing, sir? Sorry about that. Uh, let's go ahead and get your documents. Thank you so much. You got two toilets. You got to take a lot of shits, huh? Go ahead and step out. Let's just get those out. I don't even need to take them out. Actually, to open them, I think I do. Sit tight. All right, let's look at his vehicle. I have a feeling this is going to be a regular push through. All right, looking good in there. Nothing that I can see inside the hood either. Okay, go ahead and sit tight. Let's get this open. Yeah, he's solid. I'm going to get this confirmed. You could get this push back. I wish that I could just put it back. Like if I could easily take it all out, I should easily be able to put it all back in. All right. We're going to immediately start with checking this guy's stuff. So two toilets, two toilets. Looking good on that. That is going to be his face. I should be checking that at first every time. Uh, Sevda, Sevda, S-N-Alive. S-N-Alive. 
one nine two nine one nine two nine eight frank six seven eight frank six seven january 26 1981 so unfortunately that is expired so expiration date see i just wish we could pick it was for the entry permit instead of his passport you know what i mean uh january 10th they're actually both expired well never mind they're both fucking expired uh passport number one nine two nine oh we already did that photo good cargo list is good i believe this guy's gonna be turned around anyway due to entry regulations because he's carrying two toilets. He can't have goods or luggage. I would assume toilets would be constituted as household items. So yeah, I, I mean, that's gonna be a denial. All right, I think we're good on the inspection report though. Wait, there was two, yeah. All right, sir. We're gonna go ahead and deny you today. Unfortunately, you're gonna have to turn around. Please don't do anything stupid with your toilets. We don't need those installed yeah, here top. in this beautiful state, all right? Thank you so much. Oh, you fixed your own life. Nice. Wasn't sure if you were going to be smart enough to figure that out. Make sure you pull all the way through. I got enough rounds to go through your skull, sir. Keep turning that fucking wheel. That's what I thought. All right, next. Oh, I don't think he is fixed, actually. Don't go back to that door. I'm, like, scared to look there now. Uh, driver did not meet. So we messed up on something. I'm not sure what. Uh, name, surname, cargo list. See, why is it doing... Okay, how am I supposed to click that, though? And, like, am I missing something here? Sorry. Oh, no, that's weird. All right, uh, documentation. I'll look again really quick, but I don't understand what it's trying to tell me. Step out. Just shut up. No one cares about your brother-in-law. So, like, on the inspection report, there's literally... There's literally only one... Yeah, there's literally only one. But yet, I... What? I feel like the game's broken, but yet it's... Trying to... It's, pen, it's penalizing me for its brokenness, but alright. Alright, sit tight, sir. Let me just check your stuff here. I can't get in your car. I won't find anything. Well, let me be the judge. Thank you. Oh, this shit bone dry. You're actually you're, you're not lying, huh? Okay, stand right in the way. So I think he's going to be one of those guys that could be pushed through because he's from that area, and he has no luggage, which means that uh, as long as he's not trying to get contraband in, it's pretty much going to be a push through. As long as all of his documentation checks out on top. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and take a look at your stuff here, sir. So, as, as a mat, as a mat, Abby Love, okay. Ida 2, young 4, Ida 2, young 4, new, new, Nora Union 25, Nora Union 25. Correct on that. July 6th, 1981, he's got some time. Uh, let's see, January, February. Okay, he's uh, good on that one as well, too. Actually, the month. So, this one's going to be a straight push with this guy which is good good to see someone not fucking up why is it doing that i didn't mark that did i oh i think i did when i was doing the example thing i just want to check this really quick i know it's a match so yeah that's weird there's like no specific way to like oh shit there's the kgb files and then cash that's like the mound of dirt i was talking about so i bet you there's a whole bunch of cash uh, at the cemetery so we should probably go there one day uh, economy, I don't think this has anything. Staff. I'm trying to see if there's anything that has to do with what they're trying to say about this, like, dual name thing. Yeah, there's nothing. Shut the fuck up. Alright, I don't think there's any issues with this guy. He has nothing. You're gonna be free to go through, sir. Enjoy your time. Thank you so much for your patience, you asshole. Yeah, there it is. Barely crack a smile at this checkpoint, yet they're just laughing up the goddamn storm at the other one. Next! Yep, yeah, fuck you. I hope your door gets taken off, asshole. How you doing, sir? Don't try to go through. Better stop with your goddamn goats. They're both real, right? Been having a lot of motherfuckers fake me out lately. Oh, perfect inspection. Good stuff. Documentation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate you. Uh, if you want to hop out, I'm going to get his uh, sheep unloaded. You look petrified. You're going to be used in some sort of goddamn seance later, I could tell. I'm going to get these marked really quick. Honestly, they look like... They're broken. Lockjaw or something. Uh, put it back. Yeah, put the devil goats back. 
Thank you so much. All right, sir. Let's go ahead and check uh, your vehicle, actually. I'm going to open this. All good. Tire checks out. Metal. Good. Nothing in the vehicle. Low, whoa. We go way lower than the car. All right, I think this guy's going to be good, too. Not everyone's going to be a smuggler. Poor goats. All right, sir. Let's uh, see what's going on with your stuff here. Oops. So, cargo list. Confirmed cargo, too. Good on that. Face. Uh, I don't know. No, those eyebrows. No, those eyebrows are scary. Okay, uh, I'm going to go ahead and... do. That's not what I wanted. Uh, photo. I can just keep it open since we're done with the cargo list. Ron, that is the most normal name I've seen. Uh, T, uh, Tom, Sam, Edward, Robert, Edward, Nora, Adam, David, Ida, Mary. Okay, check. Uh, Victor X-Ray 66, Victor X-Ray 66, R214, check. Uh, December 9th. Okay, I already know that that's not good. Expiration date. April 4th. Oh, that's fucking expired too. Uh, Kazakhstan, I'm sure I butchered that. That doesn't really reflect on anything that's going on. Cargo list checks out. Uh, he's not from that area, so no, no entry regulations. Okay, I think we're going to be good to... Let me just verify this. I'm just going to do this really quick. That's a match. Oh, I didn't even look before it gave me the... Okay. Alright, it's going to be a... Uh, Denial on him. I'm not really sure if the... I'm going to do one more quick justification. I need to get close up and personal, sir. How you doing today? No, I want to say it's a no on that. So we're going to stick with the photo. And we're going to deny this guy. All right, sir. Sorry about that. Denied. You can take your two goats. Go fucker. Go fuck yourself. I don't care. Okay? Technically, it is over because I have uh, the checkpoint ambushes off still. So, ha. Fuck you. Oh, wait, do I? Yeah, I do. Thank God. I mean, those kind of take me out of what I... Like, I, I got in here last time. Uh, we did, like, the last round of stuff. And it was, like, certain stuff. Like, I don't mind the missions, but certain other stuff was like, come on now. Yes, yes. Perfect. Oh, my God. That scared the fuck out of me. You could tell we did not get promoted a lot last time. Because that absolutely scared the shit. You can call Vlad to, to come with his tools. Wait, what? Hold on. Sorry, sir. One sec. That was not... Did we not even get ranked up last time? We sucked so much ass. Hold on. Well, where the fuck is Vlad? How do you get a hold of Vlad? Interesting. I don't know where we would go to do that. It's not like I have a cell phone here in the 80s, so... I don't know. That's weird. Okay, well, step out. I must have missed that last time, but where... Where would we get a hold of Vlad? Unless, like, the mailbox... All right, sir, sit tight. Let me uh, get the inspection done. Please do your job. There's nothing illegal there. Well, I will check. You might be right, sir. Well, I might have to look into that. I, di I didn't see anything about that in the handbook at all. So, like, there's certain things that is just completely hidden. Because if we missed that, which we totally did miss that the last time, then we would never be able to see that shit again. That's for sure. Hello. These better all be real, dude. That one wasn't moving. I don't know. Oh, I just fucking ate the cow. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to do quick cargo check. Oh, we didn't put that one on a table. It's just sitting there. Chilling. Not going to run off. It's a very well-behaved cow. I just tried to check my partner in as a confirmed cargo. All right, sir, over here. How you doing? So uh, everything checked out minus the hood because I didn't look in there. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and look at your information. Sorry about running into you. Did I not grab your information? Oh, my bad. Well, I'll find out if everything's all right, right? So, one cow, ten chickens. What a haul. Uh, confirmed cargo, one cow, ten chickens. So, he's good on that. I'll keep the inspection open. That looks like him for sure. So, we're good on that. Uh, let's see. Sevda... Uh, young Adam, George, Sam, Young, Edward, Victor, good. So 9810, Lincoln, 7, Frank Young, good. May 11th, next month, so he's good. August, he's got some time. March 20th, doesn't matter. King of Erky, he is uh, traveling with goods. Does that mean I have to stop him? Because I think it said... 
goods and luggage. I would assume that that would constitute as... Okay, it just generalized it as goods here. So that's definitely going to be an entry regulation, unfortunately. When I believe everything else is going to check out with this guy, which is... Uh, which it did check out. So photos, good. Cargo list. Nope, that's not what I want. Entry regulations. Because that's what it would be is uh, goods. So everything else is going to be solid. Let's just do one quick check there. We're solid. All right, we're going to have to deny this guy entry. Sorry, sir. Fuck. Got to put your fucking livestock back in the goddamn... Where are you? Fucking moron. Nada. What are you, scribbling just Nada. random Nada. shit on a little cart? You trying to be like me? Why don't you get out there and man the other portion of the checkpoint that doesn't fucking exist? All right, sir. Well, you're going to have to turn around. Please do not try to barrel through the freshly remade checkpoint there. We just had to put it back up after someone attempted to... Well, they did run it down. He didn't make it too far as I shot him. Good day, sir. Thank you so much. Make sure you do that uh, sharp turn there, all right? Sharp turn. Sharp turn. It's cooperating. All right, next... Last one of the day. Nice. I would say that's all been perfect so far. Perfect inspection. They're getting up there. That's what I'm talking about. How you doing? Uh, documentation, please. Thank you so much. I'm going to go ahead and get your luggage out of the vehicle. Never mind, I can't. Can you get the fuck out of the car? Shut the fuck up. You're whispering. I was already on the other side of the vehicle, sir. Okay, let's uh, get his luggage out really quick. Turn my flashlight on. Okay, we've got something here. That's on the back, too. I usually don't say. I swear to God, they're hitting new spots right now. Alcohol. Nice. Okay. How much is it? 340? Last time I didn't take them. I'm taking them this time. Oh, and it's just a push through. Oh, I should have took more contraband. <laughs> Have a good day. I guess. I mean, shit. Fuck it, right? Might as well. I didn't take them last time. Between that and the KGB files, we're going to upgrade this goddamn camp. Way sooner. Also, I think we're going to get better upgrades, but we'll see. Is Comrade, like, not going to... Oh, shit! What is the point of that? Oh. I ought to fucking hit him in his face, bro. That is the... the you, you, you're damned if you do. You're damned if you don't. What the fuck? All right, everyone. That is going to be where we wrap it up. Fucking welcome to land of the bullshit here. That's what it is. I swear to God. I'm just not going to take him then. We're now just not going to take him. That way I can get... A solid record. It doesn't matter. We kind of did that one on purpose, though. But uh, we did great progress today. All of them were perfect. And that's what I wanted to do this time around. So if we could just keep up with that, we are solid. So nonetheless, thank you so much for watching this episode of Contraband Police. And we will see you next video.